your story? What's your sign? It's like we're twin flames in a different life. Deep connection, lights a spark. It's like you know me in the depths of my heart. We're dreamers. Welcome to another video. Um, I've gone, I've gone. Uh, what's the word? Novelty today with my hat. Um, yeah, I feel a bit silly. Look a bit silly, but when I get into the park, I look like everyone else. Um, I've also only put um, concealer under my eyes. So at the minute, because I've just put it on, it looks very silly. But hopefully, it will blend in. Yesterday wearing a mask I just got cake cakey makeup all on my face so um I decided not to do that today um so yeah we're checking out Santa Fe now um we're gonna check into Cheyenne later today once we've been in the parks um so yeah we're just about to head off so uh, come with us <laughs> So we're just outside the Cheyenne, um, Adam's just checking us in um, and then we're going to head off to the parks, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah. Yeehaw. We love Cheyenne, don't we? Yeah. It's one of our favourite hotels. Did anyone guess what ride we're on, Riley? What ride are we on?
now we're just in Hakuna Matata. We're gonna have some lunch. This is mine today. I've gone for the chicken strips and the fries. Um, that comes with a yogurt and a drink. Isabel, what have you got today? I got apple juice and rice and chicken. Lovely. What have you got, um, Riley? I've got the same as Isabel, but I've got a spirit as my drink. Oh, lovely. And what have you got, Daddy? I've got the lion's feast which is a chicken wrap with chips and then a coconut cake and a bottle of water to be healthy. Lovely, it looks delicious. We've just finished our lunch. Um, Riley's watching Shark Tank and Isabel's watching Shark Tank. Um, it was the best. Yeah, it was the best lunch I fancy thought it's I especially like the rice instead of the chips which yeah. is very nice yeah. what did you think of the ice cream that you had you had the Olaf didn't you really nice yeah I got to have some of Isabel's because she didn't finish hers yeah you were full up weren't you yeah yeah what did you think of your lunch it, it was so yummy <laughs> yeah. and, and I liked the chips and the rice you stole some of daddy's chips didn't you yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right, we're just going on our next ride. And which one do you think this one's going to be? I'll give you a clue. What one is it, Riley? Star Tours. Star Tours. And this is one of Isabel's favourite rides, isn't it? Yeah. So she's really excited. <laughs> How excited are you, Isabel? Larry, do you like do you like this ride? Yeah. Yeah, is this one of your favourites? Yeah. That's good, isn't it? We've just got off the ride. What ride did we go on, Isabel? Uh, What's it called? Star Tours. Star Tours. And how much fun was it? A hundred. Was it? And what, what was it like? What did you do? What did it do? I don't know. Did it go really fast? Yeah. Did it throw you around everywhere? Yeah. Was it lots of fun? Yeah. That's good. What do you think of the chippies, Madison? Are they yummy? Yum yum. Yum yummy. Say yum yum. Yeah, I know. You like them, don't you? Maestro music. Long as well, wasn't yeah, it? yeah, it was about 15 minutes, maybe just under, wasn't it? Um, yeah, yeah. And now we're going to head on over to studios and see what we can get done over there. Hey, all the others, they're going on Crusher's Coaster now, but me and Madison, we're going to go on the magic carpets, aren't we? We're going to go up high in the sky on the magic carpets. So we'll do a little bit of filming on there, hopefully. Well, we were going to go on the magic carpet, but look who's just shown up behind me and Madison. It's 
at Ratatouille. Look at Ratatouille. Look at him go. Look at Madison. Madison, look. We're up high flying. Look. Madison's loving the magic carpet, aren't you? Look, Madison. Right, Isabel, what ride are we going on now? We're going on the car, the ride. Oh, I don't spin around. It's been around and around. Do you like this ride? Yeah. Yeah. And, and I like Crusher's Coaster as well. Have you just and been on Crusher's Coaster? Yeah, and it was so good. It is so good. What happened yeah. on Crusher's Coaster? So it, so it moved all everywhere. Did you? Yeah. Did it stop working whilst you were on it? Yeah. It did. <laughs> and I was up to the top and just stayed on the top. <laughs> <laughs> favorite things to do she was so excited to see it again um, now we're gonna go on Tower of Terror. for your safety once on board please remain seated with your seatbelt fastened keep your hands on the speed and those inside the elevator at all time and do take special care so we've just come off Tower of Terror and guess who came on with us this time? <gasps> the Brave is about again. Did you enjoy it this time? Yeah. yeah, it was a different one this time than last time, wasn't it? Different little girl. Did you like it? Yeah. What did you like about it? Well, it goes up and down. It goes up and down. Yeah. Did mummy and daddy yeah. scream louder than you? Yeah. Yeah. But no, you didn't scream, but Who's mommy and daddy. Who screamed the loudest? <laughs> Me. <laughs> no, not as loud as daddy. Shall we go and find the rest of the crew to tell them? Yeah. Bye. Bye. Well done, Isabel. I'm the
this cold December day, we are on our merry way, riding along, just singing a song, barreling through the snow. Bells are jingling, snowflakes tingling, Rudolph knows where to go. On this cold December day, I am piloting my sleigh. The work to be done on my Christmas run is the most tired chore. No girl or boy without a toy, so giddy up, Rudolph, my dear. What are we going on now, Riley? We're going to go on Ratatouille. Here we are. Yeah. Here! Huh? What do I buy there? Cocoa? No. A simple almond? Too simple. What? May we? That's it! restaurant so we'll take you there and show you what it's like and look who's saying goodbye today it's Christmas Day restaurant in um, the Hotel New York and we've got an all-you-can-eat buffet. Uh, Madison's just tried to grab Isabel's food. Um, so we'll show you some of the food that we get and we're just about to stuff our faces. Um, so Isabel, what have you got to eat? Um, I got this uh, Apple juice, yeah. And you've got some wedges and you've got some um, yeah. pasta as well, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah? And I got some pasta. Yeah. Mm. Looks yummy. Right, Riley, what do you have? So I've got pizza yeah. and some barbecue and some pizza. Wings? Wings, yeah. yeah. And some ham yeah. uh, and a green burger. That oh, looks lift it up. Nice. Let me see. Oh, no, not the whole burger, you banana, just the lid. Oh, 
<laughs> I just want to see what's inside. Yeah. Lift the lid. Oh yeah, lovely. Yeah, very nice. What have you got, Daddy? I've oh got, my gosh, you've got everything. Yeah, well, no, there's loads more still to go. I've got a burger, some chicken. Oh, that's not chicken. That's Christmas turkey. Christmas turkey. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like chicken. <laughs> I've got some potatoes, chicken wings, some ham, and a crab sandwich. Oh, fantastic! <laughs> I'm gonna go and get mine now. So I've got my second plate now, and I've gone for another pizza, and I really liked it. I've got some rice, and some noodles, and some sweet and sour pork, sweet and sour pork, yeah, and I've got this fried pork in a spring roll. Yeah, and it looks very nice, so. What do you think so far? Oh, it's vegan, so yeah. it's my favourite, <laughs> yeah. What about you, Daddy? What have you got? Well, I've gone for sea bass. Mm -hmm. I've gone for duck in hoisin oh. sauce. I've gone for sweet and sour pork on some rice, some noodles, and then the pork in a fried spring roll again. Lovely. And I've gone for quite a basic um, thing, really, a macaroni cheese. Um, the rice, the noodles, and the sweet and sour pork, which looks delicious. So I started eating mine without showing you because I was so excited. Um, so I've gone for a Christmas dinner with the potatoes, the green beans and the turkey. And then I've gone for pizza on the side, which is very sophisticated. Um, Adam, what have you got? I've gone for some more sweet and sour pork because it's so lovely. Pizza and a couple of meatballs. Oh, very nice. What have you gone for? Um, uh, one oh. slice of pizza <laughs> and a red one. Yeah. Very carby. And then you go yeah. to the dessert after, aren't you? Yeah. yeah, they look fantastic. Yeah. Right, so Riley's just been on the prowl on his own for dessert. Now, what have you got here? Um, I've got a strawberry cheesecake and a lemon cheesecake. And I just picked up a little strawberry. Um, yeah. But I can't quite remember what it's called. These are macarons aren't they yeah. avengers macarons and that is a panna cotta under there and if you put the shield back down it's captain america yeah. fantastic yeah. you're looking forward to tucking into all this oh, yeah. <laughs> right well i thought as i was on holiday i would go for another no there's some kind of creature <laughs> next to me here i'd go for a third plate um, so I've gone for my favourite, the um, biggie, biggie, sweet biggie. and sour pork. <laughs> and then um, rice noodles. And I wanted to try the sea bass. I don't think she left any for anyone else. Oh, uh, whatever. <laughs> okay, Adam, what have you bought for dessert? I've got a baby group chocolate mousse. Yeah. A little carrot cake. Mm -hmm. A raspberry cheesecake. I think this is a strawberry cheesecake, a passion fruit cheesecake, a chocolate cannoli, cannoli and What's a little that? lemon meringue. Oh, fantastic, very nice. This is for starters. <laughs> so, Riley's just nipped up for um, an extra dessert or two, he said, um, and the waiter came back before he did to bring this for him. <laughs> Do you not eat at home? No. <laughs> <laughs> that looks what amazing. Um, well, I've got this very decorated fruit salad which looks which the man did all for me with this white kiwi. Oh, very nice. Yeah, I've got this chocolate filled thing here. Yeah. And I've got a tiny meringue. And I've got a... Um, That's like passion fruit, isn't it? Yeah. And I've got... Um, like an egg custard tart, egg tart type tart. thing. Yeah. And I've got some fruit that I picked off mm, the top. Very <laughs> nice. I hope you eat all that. You're not allowed to leave till you've eaten every last bit of it. Okay? <laughs> okay. Ready? Go. Okay, this is my dessert. This one is not mine. This is Madison's. I've gone for the passion fruit cake, um, the macaron, I've gone for two of these because they look amazing and of course a baby fruit chocolate mousse.
also we've just checked in to Hotel Cheyenne. Uh, yeehaw! So I thought I'd just give you a quick room tour. Well, room of my room anyway. Adam's is a bit different. Um, so I've got a bed, a uh, bedside table, um, curtains. I mean the curtain poles are a little bit skew withy. Uh, one one of it, one of the sides is uh, down. Uh, but that's okay um we've got some like a bench here for like sitting or extra storage or whatever this was on the bed but madison very kindly took it off for us um nice themed mirror bin on the side of course baby proofing um this amazing boot lamp this is my favorite part of a cheyenne room i just love that it's so cool um a much bigger telly than the santa fe um plugs as well are better um there's two usbs a uk plug and then two european um loads of storage absolutely loads um i went for the bedroom with the oh sorry madison's just having a bit of a a bit of a bottle war over here with everybody's water bottle she's having a great time um sorry i went for one of these rooms with the like the pull out beds um, when we've come with the boys before, before Madison was born, these worked great because it gave them their own space instead of sharing a double bed. Um, and the room space, when you don't have to pull it out, is incredible. Adam's room is next door. Oh, here we go. You all right there, Madison? You okay? Yeah? I know. Um, Mad um, not Madison's room. Uh, Adam's room is this one here. It's adjoining. We've never had an adjoining room before. Um, his is the two double beds, so it's much smaller feeling anyway. Um, coat hooks, lifesaver. I didn't have any of those in the Cheyenne. Um, this again, lovely little cubby hole for the buggy to be pushed right under. Oh, Madison, I'm so sorry, guys. Um, yeah, that's really handy for the buggy to be pushed, pushed in. Um, Aircon at Cheyenne, not at the Santa Fe. Um, the same kind of storage up above there. Again, shoes for the baby proof so she doesn't chew them. Um, so, oh, Madison, what are you doing? So, oh, dear, it sounds like you need a house. Um, coat hangers, lots of storage. Uh, yeah, storage underneath there too. Um, this is the bathroom. Not as themed, not really themed in here to be honest. Um, you do have the lovely toiletries. Um, space up there, towels, a toilet, um, shampoo, and then we've got the, the shower and the Oh, is this the bit of theming that we're looking for? Yes, the shower curtain is themed, kind of. Oh my goodness me. We're not going to have any water bottles left when I finish this video. Madison's also very kindly put two um, baby Yodas in the bath, which we bought today. Um, so that was nice of her. So, yeah, this is the Cheyenne room. Um, very happy with it. Um, I've had to go over and give it a bit of a clean, um, it's quite dusty, um, but I suppose that's the difference with it being a wooden floor, is that you can actually tell it's dust, whereas in other hotels that have carpet, you don't, you can't tell, so, um, so yeah, um, and also, um, Adam had to rescue me, there was a massive spider in here when I first came in, but apart from that, very happy, um, now we've got to unpack and get the baby ready for bed. Hi guys, so um, before I start, please excuse the state of me. I have the worst, and it's the best, the worst hat hair ever. Look at that. Just look at it. Absolutely disgusting. Um, so I'm sorry about that. Um, oh, Madison's just bringing me her coat. Hang on. <laughs> sorry about that too. Um, uh, yes, so um, another really busy day. Um, it did rain for a little bit today, not too much. Uh, quite lucky, really. Um, but we did get wet. Um, so feeling a little bit soggy on top of 
um, that, but it was a good couple of hours ago. Um, so yeah, I don't really have an excuse for looking this way, but I'm gonna use that. Um, we've just checked into the Cheyenne, um, had a couple of problems trying to get our rooms together. Um, uh, yeah, we waddled home from the Hotel New York. We went to the downtown restaurant for our dinner and oh my goodness, by the time we'd finished, I just, I don't like to tip me out of my chair and just roll me out there. It was, yeah, it was fantastic. It was the best um, we can eat. I think that even tops um, inventions when we went. Not, not the atmosphere of the characters, but... Um, the the food was absolutely amazing definitely try and get there if you can i'm really sorry about the noise it's madison she's got these bags from the bathroom and she's just so proud and happy to have them she's just there she is hello can you start rustling please i'm trying to make a video <laughs> <laughs> oh no you can't have it pick up your bags so yeah sorry about the rustling um yeah incredible really lovely um yeah it was just really a lovely experience um believe the hype it's fantastic um we've got we've got an we can eat breakfast tomorrow morning at the cheyenne and we just don't know how we're gonna manage it because we're just so full um i don't think it's gonna gonna wear off in time for breakfast but um We'll give it a go, I'm sure. Um, so yeah, another lovely day. Um, Isabel went to see her favourite dream factory again and that was just to see her so happy jumping about. Well, not jumping, but clapping her hands. She was jumping in her seat. Um, it was really lovely. Uh, yeah, highlight of my day, I would say. Um, yeah, we had lunch at Akuna Matata. That was lovely too. Um, yeah, had a, had a nice day. Um, we're actually getting out quite late each day to be honest and staying later because um yeah with with having to get all the children ready and stuff kind of works in our favor uh, i know we miss magic hours but um i don't know with 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 them all how we would manage that to be honest um so we find that as the day goes on um kind of peaks kind of lunch time from then on it does get quieter and quieter in the parks um and just like in the summertime when we went and we got so much done towards the end of the day like the evening that's what we're finding again this time um so so yeah it's been a productive day um we've had lots of fun uh, not too cold today a bit rainy but not too cold which was really good um yeah so tomorrow we got breakfast um, first thing, uh, dining reservation tomorrow is Chez Remy. So we're having a bit of a studios day tomorrow until then. And then after Chez Remy, we will nip over to the other park too. Um, we're really hoping to catch the nighttime version of the parade. Um, cause we didn't get to see it yesterday, but we'll just see. Cause for the next few days, it's actually on at like four something, either 4.20 or 4.45 and it's not dark. So um, they might put the lights on, but it won't really look the same, we don't think. So we're going to hold out for Friday, Saturday and see um, see if we can get there. Um, so, yeah, uh, thank you for watching again. Um, if you haven't already um, liked, subscribed, commented, then please do. Um, we put a Disney parade video on our channel. Um, if you haven't watched that yet, make sure you check it out. It is really lovely. It's got the castle in the background and the whole parade. Um, and you can see um, some of the characters are saying hello to Isabel, which is really lovely. Um, so yeah, make sure you check that out too. Um, thank you for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye bye. <laughs>